Hey guys, it's Jimmy here, and welcome back to another anime reaction. Today, we're reacting to Majuku Tensei Episode 4. That is right, I am looking forward to it, so I just want to get right into it. But of course, if you do enjoy today's reaction, though, make sure to smash the like button, get subscribed so you don't miss our future anime reactions. And of course, I will be bringing this down for YouTube, so if you do want the full link for reaction, consider supporting my Patreon, always appreciate it. Get full link for reactions, exclusive anime reactions, and so much more. But for right now, though, let's get into it. I forgot Rudus went with that guy's group last time. We know. And we know that the elf girl is trying to find Rudus now that she heard news of him in this town. Is he gonna feed a dragon today? Because he said like in the last episode that he'll feed a dragon. So this is like will we get a dragon fight? That would be pretty cool. Looks like we got more of those bears from last episode. Looks like they're ready to the fight, dude. I just know if Rudus actually took it seriously, he could probably go all out against them and probably destroy all of them with no problem. To be honest with you guys. Looks like he turned them to mud, so that way he can attack them up close. That's really gonna mess them up. What's the difference between a black grizzly and a white grizzly? I will still never know. This guy, though, is so strong. The guy who's, like, working with Rudus now. Who's being, like, a bro. Dude, they did not stand a chance. What's going on? The dragon's coming now, bro. Also, I want to quickly fact check that. Technically, that would be a wyvern. If you don't know, usually wyverns, dragons are four-legged. Wyverns are two-legged, but have wing hands on their arms or wings. So, that's just a fact check. There's like a whole dragon biology thing somewhere. I'm not going to show it on screen, but you get the general idea. That thing's a menace, though. It reminds me of that one thing from Monster Hunter. Look, like Aruos is taking it serious, though, now. Yo, he's just running on top of it. That's sick. Is he gonna collect it? Negate it? He counted it with a wall of water. Oh, it looks so good! It looks so good! He's gonna- it's like a sniper, that's- oh my god! Jesus! Everyone's just in shock. No, the guy's just not surprised. He's like, I know my boy Quagmire, he's got this. <laughs> That's so good, man. That is so freaking good. Honestly, there's no other fight this episode. I, I'd be honestly satisfied with just that, because I'll get that one. We're just working out even more now. I just realized we're no longer in the snowy tundras. It looks like we're now like in actual like uh some sort of countryside. And our boy's just working out, man. He's about to be like so jacked, dude. <clears throat> Did you know something wrong? But he's got a weird look on his face. It looks I think he's self-improved and he's happy because how it turned out. Oh, the elf girl is here. Holy thighs. They don't realize Quackamai is here the whole entire time when they're doing that story. It's, it's kind of funny. Yeah, yeah。Hey、yo、what? Bro's like, I worked out plenty, so I don't blame her for being after me. Huh? 
きましたわねハグレミをほぼ単体で撃破したとかううまあ相手も死にかけてましたがねロキシーが自慢するのもわかりますわね師匠に自慢されるって聞くとなんだかくすぐったい何触ってるんですか無頼とですわたくましいですわね She's like talking about him when he wants to know more about Roxy Roxy when he's she's like down bad my, even if she gets the fun part, boys, we all know he's not mentally ready for it yet. Oh my god. <laughs> she is so down bad, bro. Hmm. <laughs> Bro, I thought he was going in for a kiss and he got caught off guard. Look, everyone's just watching them, bro. That's funny. She always teases men. She's like, I never tease men, I tease men. Bro. She's she's got good news for him what's the good news though oh she finally figured he finally figured out where his mother's at she's in a labyrinth in a certain region so it's gonna take me more than a year to travel over there to get there plus it's winter so it's gonna probably even take longer so it's time for the training arc, boys. That's all I'm hearing. Oh my god. The sauce be real, bro. He learned she's very saucy, if you know what I mean. Dude, she's like out of an HR film or not safe to work film, bro. It's ridiculous. I'm gonna probably cut the audio from this because YouTube will be on my butt if I like include any audio in this segment. <laughs> Her voice is not ready for this. He like knows that she's saucy, but this is ridiculous, bro. I've been suffering from a disease, so this is kind of like torture for him. <laughs> bro, he's so upset. Oh my god. <laughs> Poor guy. <laughs> it's so funny like it's so bro i god this is ridiculous man poor guy oh my god he's the next oh my god he's getting in a piece of it too i wasn't trying to make a move on your woman it's not like that bro Bro, I was like, I know you can't get up either, too. So it's like, yeah, I opened up some bad wounds, dude. That's funny, though. <laughs> He's like, lucky bastard. Our boy is so jealous. He wants to get some shame shots on them, though. So he should slap whoever you like. Like, it's like to slap them really hard for fun. It's so funny though that even his like, guild teammates are getting in on this and it's just like just funny because he can't do anything in the first place, bro And he's not jealous at all. He's already trying to play, but you know, we all know he's down bad if he could work Or function the same very least Yeah <laughs> Bro, 
So it looks like instead of they pay her to have some fun time, she pays them. But also it's like a make sure like the hey, don't fall in love with me kind of deal. That's interesting. Wait. How does she not get... Huh. I presume she would use magic so she doesn't get preggers, but maybe that's me thing. Me just being logical. ルーデウス・グレイラットその素晴らしい技術をさらに磨くおつもりはありませんか？ラノは魔法大学はあなたを特別生として招くようになります。特別生。特別生とは受賞面授かつ学士免授、香港の蔵書や設備を使う自由に研究対応なさ。So it looks like our boy is being invited to a school. Since he's so uh, important, like his value in itself is so unique because it's what he's done already. So they're inviting him as a special student. And of course, he can use the resources from that to further their growth. Oh, yeah. I forgot he was going to go to the magic school down the line before the whole magic incident. So it looks like this is like bringing up some bad old memories. So he can take advantage of this to go there again. And we already know who's most likely there. What did Paul do to her to make her hate her so much? Hate him, her that hate him so much? That's my question. So it looks like he's gonna pass it up, but looks like the human god is here. Well, I don't think we've seen him for a long time. It's been totally two years since we last seen him. First, congratulating him that he found at least he's found his mother. Like, even if the home guy could have probably helped him and easily found her, but we well, you know this guy supposedly has a bad reputation in the past, so I presume he doesn't intervene like all the time. Where the god wants them to go to the magic school. Looks like he's sung not to go to where the dungeon is right off the rip because something bad will happen. He doesn't want doesn't want him to, to go there. So he's time to go to the Magic University instead. Why does he look all godly and stuff? It's kind of weird. He's supposed to be like an evil god or supposable evil god. He looks like an actual like good god in this instant. Bro's like it will cure him of his problem. For a moment. He's telling him to go there so that way he can cure his possible disease somehow. And he's wondering how. Hey, yo, what's going on here? Bro, his CL doesn't even work even though he's next to beauty in bed. Oh. 
<laughs> He's still making sure it's working. Bruh. Has a beautiful beauty right next to him, but can't get any function from his uh, snickerdoodle. Feels that dude, that's gonna hurt, bro. So bad. Looks like this guy's upset to see Quagmire leave. ま、ありがとう。this guy looks like a bad guy, but he's not a bad guy. Like, he has a kind side since they opened up to each other. And they worked for a few years. Dude, I, I hope we don't. I hope we don't. Um, uh, Not don't. I want to see that guy more often. Hopefully in the future, we'll see him in future episodes for some reason. Because he was like one of those background characters that was cool, right? And he opened up a little bit more. So we get to see a little bit more of him. I feel like we might see him in the future, but I'm not entirely sure either. I just know this uh, whole anime has a tendency to uh, go beyond. You know what I'm saying? Our boy's working out so hard. I just know we're going to have a lot of new characters within the next season, next uh, arc. Supposedly, after this episode, we're going to have a, uh, a break in between everything until August 6th. And then August 6th is supposed to be coming back, which I'm looking forward to. That was episode four, Majuku Tensei. Dude, I'm not gonna lie, this episode was good. We got a fight, good fight action scene right off the rip. So we find out he versus the dragon, defeats the dragon, he versus the white bears, and they weren't the black bears. I still don't know, know what entirely the difference is. Uh, who knows? But during that whole process is that he finally gets found by uh, Foxy's friend, which is the elf, and she is down bad, if that wasn't blatantly obvious. What I find it so funny that she like, hooks up with every man there but it's not like they're paying for her they're paying she's paying them and i'm not entirely sure why that's exactly the case i think she's just down bad uh which not hey that's not a bad thing man i, I just find it so funny though that uh even all the people he's worked with are getting action and of course He's just listening to it in the background. It's absolute torture because his snickerdoodle doesn't work in the first place. So it's just like, <laughs> just like bro moment. And I find it funny though, that he finally sees the man god after like two years, right? And he's like, yo, I could have told you where your mom was at, but somebody told you anyways. And honestly, man, you should go to the magic academy. He's like, you're kind of sus, bro. You're always fishy. But he's like, dude, I swear, I swear, I'm not going to let you down, brother. I got the cure. He's like, the cure is there. He's like, what? Will this solve my disease, solve my problem? And we know who's there. We know who's there. Fitz is there, or I forget her main name. I just know it's Fitz now, Guardian Fitz or something like that. But Sylphie, Sylphie, Sylphie is there, and oh, oh, dude, if you're a manga reader, light novel reader, boys, it's about to get real good. Now, I will say, though, the next arc, when does, if this does supposedly come back on August 6th, um, it's going to be an interesting one. It's like a Magic Academy studio arc, and honestly, it's going to be a lot of fun. It's going to be very sus moments, very hilarious moments, and that's all you really need to know, and I just, this episode was so good. This episode was so good. I, I do appreciate, though, that we got to see the guy go back to his normal personality once quagmire leaves or rudus leaves and i hope we don't like leave him out like i want to see more of him in the future down the line because this show has a really good reputation of introducing characters not really showing any importance to them they kind of give them like a brief like personality thing or a little update about them and then we see them later down the line and use case for like different uh things for situations and i just love that about the show like world building oh my god it is so freaking good um but yeah no it's about to be fire for the next episode i'm looking forward to it if you guys enjoy my reaction here today make sure to smash the like button get subscribed and of course i do will be breaking this down for youtube so you do the full link for reaction consider me a patron always appreciate it until then have a great your sunday and i'll see you later okay cool g-man out